There are many different ways you can put a video onto a Moodle site. I'm going to show you three. The first one, perhaps the easiest one, is via the compose a link to a, a file or a website. So I've selected that item. In Moodle, it brings me to the editing screen. I give the video a name, and I'm choosing Anamura because Anamura is a singer I heard uh, last weekend at WOMAD, and she was just great. I've already been to YouTube and got the URL for this video, so I'm pasting it in there now. I'm going to ask that Moodle opens that window in a opens that video in a new window. I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of the page now and save and return to course. When it comes back to the home page, we should see a link there on the home page of our Moodle set that's going off to the Anamura video. I'm not going to click that now just to save time, but that will open a new window and play the video directly from YouTube. Another way I can add a video is to compose a web page. So I select that in the list of drop downs where I create resources. And this one I'm going to say is Anamura embedded. So I'm going to embed this in a simple web page. Now creating a web page sounds complicated, but it really isn't. If we scroll further down to the editing screen, because I'm going to be pasting HTML code, I'm going to select this option here, the HTML toggle source button, and those angular brackets give me a slightly different view. I now need to quickly go to YouTube and find the embed code. So here, and underneath most YouTube videos, you will find an embed button. Here it is. If I click that, it gives me the code. And you can see it's already highlighted that code for me. I'm going to right mouse click, copy it, return to my Moodle site, and I'm simply going to paste that code in there. Once again, I'm going to scroll down and ask Moodle to open that in a new window. And scrolling down to the bottom of the page, you won't be able to see it. I'm now saving and returning to my course. So we come back to the home page of the Moodle site. And now we can see there are two versions of the Anna Moore video. This one here is opening up in a new window in YouTube. This one here is opening up in a new window and it's playing it directly inside Moodle because I have embedded it. And one other option is that you might want that video playing right here on the home screen without having to click anything to open an extra window. So I'm going to use the editing button that's right alongside the topic. So for topical week 12, that little hand icon, which allows me to edit the summary. And I'm going to put in here Anamura once again to indicate that this is the, uh, the name of the video. And I'm going to give that a heading. I'll give it a, might make it heading five actually. Under here, I'm going to do the same thing as I did before. I'm going to click on the HTML toggle source button. I'm going to post the code directly in there, which I've already got in my memory because I, from when I went off to YouTube. And you won't be able to see me, but I'm going to scroll down to the bottom of the page now and go save changes. So back on our home string, home page rather, we can now see that Anamura video is, is right on the and it will play right there. Underneath it, we've got the other two versions. We've got the one that goes off and plays from YouTube, and we've got the other one that is embedded in a web page. So there are three ways you can play or add videos to your Moodle site. Give it a try. Cheers.